Um, so my first question is, what is the meaning behind the name Crescent? Oh, uh, so the, may I hold it? <laughs> so the Crescent means create reminiscent. So we're not only covering the band's song or some uh, pop songs like we perform today. We also do engage in some creating original songs. So we write songs with guitar, piano, and also with the uh, MIDI, which is called, um, it's more like a program that we use to produce music. And we write our lyrics and uh, our lyricist is right here. So I think all those musical activity combined means creating reminiscent that only you know, university students can enjoy in their youth. So that's uh, how we named our RSL. Okay, so the next question is kind of for all of you guys. How did you guys think the performance today went? Well, um, I performed, I think, fine today. But, you know, I still need to work on my skills still. Uh, way more to go, way more to improve. Yeah, overall just kind of satisfied, but, you know, still more uh, effort needed, I think. Yeah. I know that all of our members were super nervous. They did try their best, and I know that we did great, aside from what individual members might think. I hope they all go home feeling good about themselves because they did good. Did anyone else want to answer the question? Or no? No? Okay. And the next question is, what songs did you guys perform today and why did you choose to do those songs for the set? Okay. So uh, we performed three songs. First song is uh, Permission to Dance by BTS. Second song is 정이라고 하자 by uh, Big Nati and 서, uh, 10cm. And third one is 나는 나비 by YB Band. And um, when we first choosing the song, we decided to do some uh, um, dynamic songs lists. So we don't want to stick to the like same atmosphere with the same vibe song. We wanted to give audience a diversity of song uh, options that they can enjoy. And also considering the period of it, the song, when the song was released, some of them are old songs, some of them are quite relatively new songs. So um, that's how we um, chose these three songs and also considering the vocal color that they have and the session color as well. Um, next question is, how did you guys perform leading up to the performance and what was the thing that you guys think you were most worried about? Oh. So anyone wants to answer? Okay, I can answer that. What was the question again? The question was, how did you guys practice leading up to the performance? And also, was there anything that you were worried about? Okay, so for practice, we met up weekly. Um, about two-ish hours a week per team. And um, the most worried thing, we were most worried about my guitar solo in the second song. And um, just overall performance overall, yeah. Uh, the beat, drum, uh, piano, guitar overall. We were just worried uh, about mistakes in general, yeah. Anybody else wants to answer? So, um, he uh, explained the entire practice process, but today we had a practice right before we went on stage. And our vocal, especially our last vocal, he, he wasn't feeling very good, like his throat was out. But I think he managed to pull through, so. Yeah, we practiced a lot leading up to this, like about two hours, twice a week-ish, and then plus some extra ones leading into it. And we practiced a lot this morning as well. And I think the thing that people were most worried about is like our, our vocal as, as well as some of the guitar solos we were a little worried about. Personally, I was just worried about like getting the timing correct with the, um, the guitar because a lot of times we play the same parts. But I think we did a good job today, of, at least on my end, of syncing it up. So. And my final question is, I heard that you guys are coming out with an album. Is that true? And if so, what's the process like? Um, how's it going? What's, what's the timeline? Uh, from, are, are you talking about like future the events? The album? Oh, okay. Is there another album? album? Oh, so right now, our team separated into two teams. In the biggest frame, it's MIDI and the session team. And session team is doing the thing like what we're doing right now, performing on the stage. And the MIDI team is more like composing, publishing an album and making, uh, that's, it, it's like a draft plan, but we were thinking of making a music video or something. 
how, um, and we're doing a lot of collaboration with, for example, with Nemesis, and we also composed a song for um, Mason Film for their OST. So throughout November, we're going to work on illustration of the album and also um, choosing which genre we're going to work on. And there are some vocals out there who could not perform because of you know time limit that we have. And we're going to um, utilize them as uh, maximum as possible and make them to uh, perform for the published version and recorded version of the song. So uh, I hope you guys are looking forward to that. It'll be in our Instagram and YouTube channel all the way over at uh, many uh, media as possible. So uh, stay tuned. Thank you guys so much and you guys did wonderful during the IGC Music Festival. <laughs> Uh, we have a concert, possibly, around November. Lots of attention for us because we're, we love the attention, we love the thrill. Thanks. We have four performances.